Okay. Tyler is live from his library. Do you want another? Do you want another? Yeah, uh, I want book? another random book. Just random. First one you get. Well, this is a big one. <laughs> See. Okay, this is Den of Thieves by uh, James B. Stewart, not to be confused with James regular Stewart. Um, <laughs> this was a national bestseller and from the year, well, before they started putting years on books. So <laughs> hey, you started cracking to that. You could have that finished by tomorrow. And it's a lot of pages. If you don't remember, Tyler, we're here with Kula and Katina, did I get that They right? were there for the episode that we did, the judging a book by its cover. Well, this is the first, this is our first, how do I put this? It's our first TV episode guests who have then returned. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's judge, judge, this, this, well, judge this book by the cover. I'm not into it. I'm not sold on it, to be honest with you. It looks like it's, it's like got difficult. Some ghostly figures here. I'm not yeah. sure if those yeah. are humans or... I feel I'm like it's going to be they're very the complicated. Is that a bridge? What is that? I, I can't really. I feel like you're looking out of a window. Oh. Could be okay. out of a window. I, I might, get it. I'm, maybe an airport of some kind. I don't know. Okay. I'm going to pass. It's 500 <laughs> pages that I don't have to. I don't have to. <laughs> you don't have time. No. no. So no I, for, I have all for, the time in the world, but no time for that. For those who don't <laughs> remember, I don't know how you couldn't remember. Um, you guys are the, the the people behind the movie Epiphany, which we're yes. going to talk about. We, we talked about it on the show, but we'll talk about it again. Um, but before we get to that, like how how have you guys been doing? And now we're moving into what? It'll be week four on Monday, right? Yeah. How has it been for you? Um, well, I, I will say Katina and I probably have very different um, things yep. going on here. Um, yep. So for us, I, you know, I didn't, my, I didn't have my kids in school that even that last Friday where they didn't even, before they closed, I was, my friends and I were texting and I was kind of freaking out. So they didn't even go then. Um, and then, you Which know, would have I, been um, March 7th, maybe. Maybe. March yeah. 7th. Before it was the day then, then the day after I think is when the governor said no school for, you know, whatever, two, 14 days or whatever. Uh -huh. Um, but so my husband works, you know, he's, he has equipment, film equipment that he rents out. That's what we do for a living. We own a company um, in Union, New Jersey, and he work, he rents it to all the shows that are filmed there, all the movies that come in. Um, and he's completely dead right now because nobody's making movies, obviously. Nobody's yeah. doing anything. Yeah. Um, so his work has really just stopped, you know. And you're, I mean, in, where you are in New Jersey, like in the Lehigh Valley, we're feeling it. Like it must be even there. You're closer to, you know, the epicenter, uh, yeah. for lack of a better term. Has that affected like your daily life? Well, no. So I'm in Pennsylvania. I'm oh, in, okay. I'm the Nazareth. company's in the company's That's in Union, New Jersey. Yeah. So I understand. Okay. Yeah. So he, you know, at, at, at first he was going to have like one guy a week in there, so they could do maintenance on the equipment and stuff, but. He just, you know, everybody's, they're doing Zoom meetings now, you know. Just <laughs> right, this is the way of the world now. Yeah, exactly. So I wonder what will be the first, like, Zoom, um, you know how a new film genre will start up? Like, I wonder if they'll do, like, Zoom movies. <laughs> Maybe we can start the first one. I know. I don't know. It was Something. funny in the news, yeah. everybody was warning us, or warning people, like, Zoom is recording your calls. And we're like... <laughs> Can they put them out to more people than <laughs> we are? Could they help yeah, us? Can they some... share them right to Facebook? <laughs> it's like, Is the cares? FBI, do they like the show? Maybe yeah. like the show. <laughs> exactly. Who cares? But, but so then the, the, the next step for me and Katina is in a similar situation, but you know, I have three kids. So, you know, we started the online learning and, you know, you got to work, you know, work, work that in. It's just hard, I think, because the kids want to, you know, it's hard to get them up when they, my daughter was up at 545 every day in the morning so to get the bus and it's like obviously i'm not gonna make her do that like that's yeah. insane. but to get them on like a schedule where you know it's, yeah, it's that would be that would be mean if you 
You're like, nope, nope. It's still five forty-five. Yeah, you're on the train. And then we'll get. I'll, I'll ask Katina. We'll ask Katina the same question. But before we do, how are your kids with it? Like, is I, I've been like trying to ask parents of kids are like, you know, they're old, they're old enough to understand what's going on, right? Yeah. And so, yeah. what's, what's their approach to how, I mean, how are they? Dealing? My my guys are. You know, um, I have like one introvert, and he'll call himself that. Like he does not care. He is kind of like, Hey, whatever. Like he really doesn't. It's just like any other day. But then my daughter who has a lot of friends, she's very active. She was supposed to be playing lacrosse right now. You know, she, she's having a little bit harder of a time. And then uh -huh. my, uh, my younger guy's just a computer guy. So he's okay too. My daughter's yeah. having the toughest time. Yeah. yeah. We were saying, how, one, how are you guys? Yeah. How are you? How are you doing? I'm fine. My yeah. my husband brought a Peloton bike home from the office that he got half a discount, and now I'm like obsessed with that. So thank God, I, you know, because I'm like a gym rat. So I was yeah. very worried about that. Um, but other than that, I'm okay. You know. Yeah. But, and how about you, Katina? Well, I'm not. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no. This is probably one of the most uh, stressful times for for me. So, You're in a little different business. Yeah, we, uh, my husband owns an essential business, not a non-essential, <laughs> an essential. So it has been. Yeah. Stressful because he's out there. He has to go daily. Is that what's stressful? Oh, and so do I. Yeah. Yeah, um, you both have we to. Have, we have 10 employees. Mm -hmm. Um. And we also have three children. So we've been just trying to keep our employees safe and, you know, keep the, the precautions and everything, the uh, gloves, the masks. Um, and we're a highly trafficked essential business. So it's, uh, it's been a, a struggle. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what I've been dealing with. So, um, I mean, <laughs> is ready is very positive i mean have you been noticed i don't know i mean trying to look on the upside has it been something where you've been surprised at like the response of what you've been able to do or yeah i mean we have a loyalty of customers we're a mom and pop shop i think people think that we're a chain but we're a mom and pop and uh you know we've seen you know our regular customers coming in everybody's being respectful we still have we're also um, we do a lot of food, so and you can name your company if you want. I don't yeah, know. Go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> our our company um, is Daisy Hill Kitchen and Grill in Salisbury Township. Oh, so it's on the corner. It's that. Uh, is that like by Valo Valos? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Right okay. Yeah. 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 Daisy essential. Hill Kitchen and Grill. That's as, as essential as it gets, in my opinion. That's essential. Good food. Are you kidding? But me? you're you're right. You guys are right by Bolite too. That's a nice little. Yeah. That's a nice there. spot too. Yeah, Aaron and Lee do a really good job. Um, I think they're doing like a, you know, a, a family takeout. Sure, I think yeah. they're great. Um, you know, they're, I, I haven't taken, you know, I haven't taken them up on it and, and done, you know, ordered yet, but I'm, I'm planning to when I actually have breathing room. A second? Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah. How has, how has your business changed and adapted over the short time since this has all started i mean you guys essential businesses like I, I it's it's insane how quickly people like you have like just ad adapted you know and yes, we like, i feel like three weeks ago we were this wasn't on our minds at all maybe it should have been but what, what what's happened in that short period of time that's well, selling, selling a lot of cigarettes man <laughs> <laughs> Everybody needs cigarettes. Yeah. So, you know, selling, selling them one at a time. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy's. <laughs> uh, yeah, at this point. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, you know, a lot of a lot of food. You know what was interesting? I put in place right before, about two weeks before all of this went down, Grubhub. Okay. Yeah, uh, that I was very lucky because I called Grubhub last week and I talked to this lady this representative out in chicago and she said when this all went down four thousand people in one day opted to do grubhub like really out of application. but i had already had one so we already had it up and running we have uber eats and grubhub mm -hmm. uh, uh -huh. so that's changed well, it's good to know that's gone up. yeah 
Yeah, I mean, we were takeout before, so we weren't really eating, so that didn't mm -hmm. affect anything, you know, we, and we're a gas station, and uh, we are in, fall into the essential. But that was when that yeah. whole thing was going down, I was like reading and combing over Governor Wolf's, um, you know, requirements. I was like, mm -hmm. oh my gosh, is there a gas station on there? And I was like, okay, where we fall into that. And then sure, was, yeah. well, should we change our hours? Yeah. We, you know, and then we decided not to, like we're 24 seven. We just opted to just keep it 24 seven. We are employing all of our people, keeping everybody. Um, oh, wow. Not like, nope. Nope. Well, I mean, that's, that's fantastic to hear. Yeah. You know, cause it's tough. I mean, with, with a lot of businesses, we, we know a lot of restaurants, you know, they can't, you know, they're doing what they can, but it's kind of, for some of them, it's impossible to even stay open. So yeah, that's yeah. just awesome. Well, but we, Joe, we, a lot of people, you know, are at home and they don't work at an essential business and they don't have anything to do. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you guys have a little bit of a solution for them. Yeah. Coming up, right? Yeah, they'll come down to Daisy because they <laughs> were like this is an essential. <laughs> well, I got that. She didn't. <laughs> Tina, what can they do from their couch? They can, they can still they can or they can order Daisy <laughs> Hill yeah. from Grubhub. She sure. does have a point. Yes. After order they the do Hill. that, <laughs> we order the Daisy Hill first because you're going to watch something. Yay! Yes, yeah, so we are, we are actually on Prime now. We are on Amazon Prime. So it's oh, free. That, that other thing that <laughs> hey, but I want to tell you guys, in the middle of all of this, um, I don't know how we did it, but Katina and I finished um, a very, you know, rough, but our first draft of our next movie. Oh, so great. Our producers have that in Los Angeles. So they're reading it over. Um, it have so you guys fancy. slept at all? <laughs> yes. Katina's running a business 24 7 and writing a movie. I feel I know, bad that, yeah, I'm a, if, if, I re, if I respond to a couple Instagram stories, I'm like, I've had a long day. I've had a, <laughs> I feel like it's so hard to the bone today. <laughs> I, I think I operate in chaos. So, yeah, yeah she does well. She, she wakes up at like 5 a.m. and she's like texting me, and I'm like, oh my God, I'm still sleeping. Leave me alone. <laughs> Anyway. But, so yeah, you, for people who aren't aware, you, you you have the movie Epiphany that people can find on Amazon Prime, yeah. so you can stream it. Are you doing like a was there a watch party or something like that planned? You know, I don't I don't really know what those are. I mean, is that like when you like contact? <laughs> I'm so old. I'm sorry. Like I see well, people on there and I'm like, what is that? So everyone. Makes, I mean, it, honestly, it makes more sense to say, hey. We're on Amazon Prime. Watch us when you want to, rather than right. say, "Hey, we're going to stream it at seven o'clock." You know, you can just, the best thing is just we'll put it. We'll put the link in there, or just yeah, search for. Did, this is a suggestion. You could you could shoot this down. I know you guys are busy. What if we did like a watch Q and A with you two? Oh, that would be great on Zoom. Good. Yeah, oh, I like that idea. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. And Have then we could maybe face we could Facebook Live it, and people can ask questions. In real time, and we could. Well, uh, I would love. We could it. definitely. To... We could definitely. Uh, th that wouldn't be that tough as long as the the Facebook Live is stable. I mean, we'll we could do it. Yeah, why don't yeah. we think about doing it? All right, we'll uh, we'll get the gears going. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I tell you what, I've worked hard today. <laughs> <It's>, yeah. <laughs> Ty, Tyler's shutting down after this, yeah. so yeah. <laughs> well it's weird too like today's a, a saturday it doesn't matter like every oh, day yeah, no. feels like wednesday you know yeah, I, or saturday i guess depending how you look at it i mean we still i know because my kids don't have work today they don't have school work so right, right. You know, it's a little different for us but um and are they having is your daughter having problems my um my one friend chris elston said like his daughter 16 and she's like, Oh, I'll, I'll meet my friend in the park and we'll stay six feet away from each other. And, you know, like trying to what teenagers do. Right. And it's funny that he's like, I'm sorry, you know, of course you can't go, but that teen, like they just, it, it sucks for them. You know, they, they're at that time in their life. They really, their, their friends are very important and yeah. it, it must be tough. Yeah. I think she hasn't, 
She hasn't really, no. I mean, we, we are no. very strict. It's like, you don't, the one thing we did, which was a huge mistake, one weekend it was really nice and we had been all been in and we were being really good, diligent about it. And we went to Jacobsburg Park. Oh. That's where Tyler went. That's oh my where, God. I'm not, I it went was, there, what, what Saturday? What, oh, it was, it was like not this past Saturday, I think, but the Saturday before it was like- Yeah, that's when I went. Fun. There was like a thousand, like yeah. thousands yeah. of people. And people were coming up to me like that, that knew hey. me and they were trying to hug me. I'm like, whoa, 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 get, 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 like, you know, get away from me, get away. Yeah. These these girls were on that little bridge that's there, and they were like like standing this far apart and talking, and made everyone go in between them. Oh. And my husband was like, "What are you doing?" He was like, yeah. six feet, girls." And they <laughs> <laughs> so annoying. So I was like, "Never again." And and same thing happened. Then after we took our kids to Chick Fil A through the drive through because I was like, you know, this is gonna be the last time they're gonna get anything. And the girl comes right up to the window. And my husband was yeah. like, I can hear you from here, you know, yeah. step, and she just comes right to the window. And it's like, what is she doing? <laughs> yeah, I think, like, I think some people are getting it slower than others. But at this yeah. point, if you're in somebody's personal space, you should know better. Yeah. So. Yeah. Well, personal space has increased in my, it, like, personal space would have been, like, I would say a foot in front of you yeah. prior to this. Now, like, if... Like hope you know when this all ends. Hopefully, it ends as soon as possible. I think my personal space is going to be ten feet. I don't know if I'm going to get within ten feet of anybody for the rest of my life. Maybe yeah. I don't know. For the rest of my life. <laughs> well, somebody oh, no. will let in. I hope. I mean, <laughs> yeah. sucks. my my daughter has this mat. It's called magnetic sand, right? Yes. And he, we, it's like yeah. yeah I, I must it. have stepped in it. I, I've got <laughs> magnetic sand on the, the bottom of my my Italian fashion shoe. I don't know how that's gonna work. All we right. Have that. We have that. We had that. So, so, so it's on. It's on Prime. You can watch. Yeah. People can watch it whenever. Yeah. Um, have you, have you gotten any feedback? Like uh, since it's went on Prime. Prime's a pretty big vehicle yeah. for, for yeah. that stuff. Well, I mean, you know, our rating on there, I think, is a four out of five. Um, somebody. I you couldn't download it, so they gave us a one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The problem with Amazon. I was like, why would you do that? I, please don't do that, because that's bringing yeah. our, our our average down. But yeah, we encourage people who have seen it on Amazon if they could give us a review. Um, it's funny. Like, it's know. harder. It's it's impossible to be critical. It's impossible to give Amazon a one star. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And you know, thank God, because they're struggling. They need yeah. all the support yeah. that they can get. You know. <laughs> but okay, so screwing, it's, it's like screwing us you know what i mean it's like yeah, yeah. I, I don't know whatever no it is it, that's, you, you never you, but you here's the thing though if you see any movie that's like five stars or 10 out of 10 you know unless it's an oscar winning movie like something's going on there you know i i need to see some i need to see some parody in there otherwise i don't know like if if, if a movie doesn't elicit both sides of it i don't know i don't trust it I need to see yeah. some middle pack reviews in there too. Yes, I agree. I agree. And I don't trust. I don't. I don't trust ratings. I don't like Rotten Tomatoes. Even, yeah. I've I've like I've seen ninety percent Rotten Tomatoes, and I hated the movie. Yeah. And I've seen like three percent. I'm like, this is really this is a really good. Yeah. Movie. So. Right. so four out of five is pretty good. Four yeah. out of five um, is good. So yeah, let's let's maybe we'll talk after this and see what we can come up with with that because I, I don't think it'd be it just comes down to how we would stream it, but what we can figure that out and so well, for people we'll we, we might be able to we might be able to do it through Amazon because I know some of the streaming services have a like a watch party feature, right? So okay, people can watch it at home, but then also be on the Zoom chat. Ah, and, I understand. Yeah. So we that, started look, that honestly time. might help help them even the more people that stream it on Amazon, I think, kicks up the algorithm. Yes, maybe. Hey, so that's I'm that's in. probably the. Yeah, good for us. Yeah. Yeah. All let's, right. let's let's talk about that. Let's do we'll do that, and also don't forget to go on Grubhub and Uber Eats and get Daisy Hell. Yes. Yeah. That's We're nice. in. <laughs> what's the What's the meal? If I'm get, getting Daisy. Like, yeah. Hell, what's what like the best doing? thing? Um, oh my gosh. 
Just like put her on the okay. spot. All right, fair. here's the scenario. I'm gonna paint the scenario for you. I'm I'm gonna I'm watching Epiphany. You know, I'm I'm getting some I'm getting I'm, I'm getting some meat, uh, some food. I want to sit down to watch a movie. What am I getting to put in front of me during my Epiphany viewing? Okay, disco fries. Oh yeah, that's good. Great cheesesteak. Okay. Um. You know our breakfast sandwiches. They're they're actually not not made in a microwave. They're actually made on a grill. Ooh. Are they? So wait, can I get them all hours? Uh, we open the grill at five. We close at eight, and then okay. on the weekend it's a little shorter. It's like six to five. So all right, good to um, know. Whitney. I think I could have used one of those breakfast sandwiches this morning. I had a <laughs> yes. I think they, they would have helped my condition. Tyler's it's, Tyler's. it's like ten a.m. for him right now. <laughs> <laughs> all right we'll uh, do that and um we'll be in touch and no we look forward to that it'd be a lot of fun if we could pull it off so yeah yeah, yeah. thank you guys cool. um all katina right. well all the best you know hang in yes. there yes stay and safe thank you for being essential um you. and yeah we'll look forward we'll talk to you guys soon okay, okay. thanks cool. guys all right thank you, you. Bye. see ya bye-bye